Hey, what's up, YouTube, and welcome back to another CJ Tweaks video. In today's video, I have some tweaks to share with you guys. Some of those tweaks will be still working on iOS 12, and some of them they already has been updated right now to work with the new jailbreak, the J Crane jailbreak iOS 13, and these will be work up to 13.2.3. So before I'm going to be start today's video, let me ask you guys to give the video a big thumbs up. Also make sure to subscribe, hit that notification bell so you will be notified always whenever I release a new CD at Weeks video. Okay, so let's start right now with the first tweak that I have for you guys, the big cars. Basically when you download the tweak, that tweak will be allow you to see the big cars right now on your switcher, just like that. So most of you guys already know that we have or we receive a lot of different kind of switcher cards from Cydia. So this is one of them. So it will be bring a big cards just like that. And basically when you download the tweak, that tweak doesn't have anything to configure. The tweak will be work right away once you install it in your iDevice. So there you go. If you're looking to download the tweak, as I told you guys, the tweak called big cards. And let's go ahead right now to talking about the next CD tweak. The next one will be the bottom banners X2. So once you download that tweak, that tweak will be provide you to receive any kind of notification on your iDevice. It will be from the bottom. It wasn't like usually it comes from the top. So this is what is going to be happen once you download that tweak in your iDevice. If we're talking about the settings, there is nothing to configure, but the tweak will be work right away once you install it in your iDevice. If I want to use right now my other device and send a message to myself to show you guys how that will be work, you can take a look at it right now. The message will be pop up from the bottom, just like so. So this is the way of that tweak. And as I told you guys, if you're looking to download the tweak, the tweak called bottom banners x2 let's jump right now to talking about the next cd tweak the tiny player pro so once you download the tweak that tweak will be provide you with nice and beautiful tiny player pro it will become once you download that tweak first of all let me just go ahead right now and jump under the settings to talking about most of the stuff that we have under that tweak so first of all go ahead and just enable the tweak and also we have the player style here so you can choose the style that you like from in there also we have a lot of different kind of customized stuff here if you want to play around with it first of all we have here on the top the custom mode settings if you top on it it will be provide you with a lot of different kind of stuff also you can customize the way that you want to how is the player will be work or the colors as you might see right now here the background color the slider here to adjust the way of that player also we have too many other stuff you might see right now here if you want to go back and here we have two different kind of style for the corners of that player and then also here in the bottom if we're talking about the apparency here we have more than section and option you can go through just you need to make sure once you're done from all those configuration and a lot of options you need to make sure to resubbing your device so your device will be take the effect and this is the way of that tweak okay so here we go we are right now using the player that i told you guys about it and then you can see i already customized the color and look of that player so once you top on the play it will give you some really nice animation here and then also it will be bring the song on top of it and also if you just stop and hold and then remove the player anywhere you want it will be work with you and then also the player will be still working once you use your springboard so it's not gonna be just on your lock screen it will be work also on your springboard so you can put that player anywhere you like so this is the way of that tweak anyway so as i show you guys this is the way about that tweak how it's going to be work once you install it in your iDevice highly recommend you guys to give it a try as i told you the name of that tweak called tiny player pro 
and let's go ahead right now to jump to talking about the next one the nota pass screen so this is will be make you to customize or they're gonna be allow you to customize the lock screen passcode so if i want to show you guys how is my lock screen right now because i already work on it so you can take a look at it right now if i want to uh, use my passcode here you can take a look at it you can customize the way of your lock screen using that tweak and if we go ahead right now and jump under the settings first of all go ahead and enable the tweak and also we have the passcode other options here you you might want to go through so also we have disable passcode rings here you can toggle that also if you want to use the custom color for the rings here you can toggle that and then choose your favorite color also we have another section here which is the passcode screen color you can toggle that and also use any color that you want to place and once you're done from all the configuration you need to make a short to resupring your device so your device will be take the effect and this is the way of that tweak if you guys looking to download the tweak that we called nota pass screen next see the tweak i will be talking about the charged up so this is will be a bring a nice and a beautiful animation stuff into your lock screen so let me show you guys so once you guys download the tweak you need to go ahead and use the excellent html in order to place that on your home screen so if i want to go right now excellent html lock screen home screen it's going to be up to you i'll be use my home screen here go under the background widget from in there and then add the widget so there you go this is the name of that widget i'm going to be top on it so you guys can see right now let me just see how is it looks like so top on ok and then you can take a look right now on the back of my springboard how is that animation will be work and this is the way of that tweak so it's going to be really nice and a beautiful animation to bring with that tweak as i told you if you're looking to download that kind of stuff the tweak called charged up at the apple watch time which is a widget you can place that on your lock screen let me show you guys first of all how is that gonna be looks like when you set that widget on your lock screen so basically you will be bring the apple watch style in your lock screen in my opinion this is gonna be really beautiful once you place that on your lock screen of course if you want to place this one in your iDevice you need to use the excellent HTML in order to make that work so if you want to place that in if you don't know how is that will be work go ahead first of all and download the excellent html you go ahead right now and tap on the lock screen and then from in here you need to go to the background widget from in there and then you can choose from the add widget find where is the uh, apple watch time and then you can place that and then you can take a look at it how is that beautiful and really nice once you want to put it in your lock screen so this is how is that will be work and this is what is the tweak is all about so this is the first one and as i told you guys the name for this one will be the apple watch time let me go ahead right now and talking about the next one so let me talk about the sonnet 12 this is will be bring a nice and a beautiful volume design into your smartphone so if i want to show you guys first of all how is that will be work let me go ahead and jump under the settings because we have a lot of customized stuff and a lot of things to talk about it go ahead first of all and enable the tweak and then also we have more than section here under the options so first of all if we go ahead right now and jump it's talking about most of the things here so we have the slider first of all the dynamic you can enable that and also we have some other option stuff here another section for the overlay so you can enable that you can uh, choose your favorite color and also we have the shadow so you can enable that the blur the corner reduce here also we have some other sliders here you can adjust that and also we have another section with a lot of different kind of options you can customize all of those 
in the really beautiful things about that tweak. Once you want to customize your hood or volume hood while you're working on the options, you can press on the volume hood to take a look how is that will be looks like. And then once you finish everything, go ahead and respring your device so your device will be take the effect. And this is the way about that tweak, which is in my opinion, it's going to be really beautiful and nice looking style of volume hood once you download that tweak. As I told you guys, really beautiful. Go ahead and try Sonus 12. Okay, let's jump right now to talking about the next one. That's transparent camera bar. This is will be make you and giving you a lot of different kind of options using your camera application. So you can customize a lot of different kind of stuff from under the settings. So before that, I'm going to be showing you guys right now how is that will be work. Let me launch my camera here and then you can take a look. It's from edge to edge. You can clear every single thing that you have in your camera. And this is the, uh, how is it that we will be provide you with. If you want to customize some stuff, of course, will be from under the settings. So here we are right now under the settings. First of all, go ahead and enable the tweak. And also we have another different kind of stuff so for example if you want to do the same thing just like me the full screen go ahead and enable that and then also if you want to uh, tap on the top bar here and you want to customize that it is available if you want to hide every single thing it is available here you can toggle that also if you want to customize the bottom uh, bar which is the gap in the bottom and uh, the one in the top you can hide all of those once you're done from all those configuration you need to make sure to respring your device so your device will be take the effect and this is the way about that tweak which is in my opinion is going to be really beautiful once you bring that kind of stuff into your camera application as i told you guys if you're looking to download the tweak that we called transparent camera bar and let's go ahead right now to jump to talking about the next one, the Easy Switcher X. This is will be bring a nice and a beautiful style of a switcher. First of all, let me just launch my switcher here. You can take a look at it. It is looks normal. But once you swipe down here, it will be bring some nice and beautiful stuff into your springboard so if you want to kill all the application which is run on your springboard or if you want to respring your device you want to reboot your device and once you tap on one of these options it will give you the confirm or cancel anyway if we go ahead right now and jump under the settings here first of all go ahead and enable the tweak and also we have the enable switcher menu which is the one that i show you already you can toggle that and also we have another option if you want to enable the confirmation in a switcher you can toggle that just make sure once you're done from all those configuration you need to make sure to resupring your device so your device will be take the effect and this is the way about that tweak as i told you guys if you're looking to download the tweak that we called easy switcher x let me go ahead right now to jump to talking about the next cd tweak centurion so once you download this one this one will be bring a nice and a beautiful shortcut or you can call it a widget into your lock screen and showing you guys most the notification that you have in in most the stuff that you have that you receive in your smartphone let me first of all show you guys how is that will be looks like so you can take a look right now here on my lock screen this is how it's going to be looks like so we will show you the icon how many notification that you already received which is going to be in my opinion overnight will be really nice and beautiful if you want to launch any one of these application from your lock screen it's not going to be work but i think the developer it might is going to be work on it in the near future and update that Anyway, if we go ahead right now and jump under the settings. So first of all, if you want to go ahead right now and choose any kind of application here from the settings. So you can choose any app that you want from in here. Simply just toggle the app that you're looking for to show up on that bar or that widget in your lock screen. It will be pop up to work right away. And the second thing, if you want to use or you want to use any kind of name, your, uh, your name, your friend's name, your favorite name, your channel name. There, you can just add the name that you like here. Once you're done, hit return, resubmit your device, and you will be see the name will be on that bar on your lock screen. 
this is what pretty much the tweak will be provided you with in my opinion it's going to be really beautiful if you guys looking to download that tweak that we called centurion so anyway guys this is the most tweak that i want to share with you guys in today's video so i hope you guys enjoyed today's video don't forget give the video a huge thumbs up and also make a short subscribe and hit that notification bell so you will be notified always whenever i release a new video catch you with the next one Peace.